Guys, welcome to today's video where I will be covering off some different tips and tricks that I've learned over the years that can help you avoid wrist or arm pain as you're gaming. All right, so if you're like a competitive gamer, you play a lot of uh, CSGO, Valorant, Fortnite, uh, wherever there's a lot of arm movement involved with like keyboard and mouse gaming, right? Uh, you can perhaps start to feel some of this over time and maybe it's just me being the boomer getting old, <laughs> starting to feel the effects of some of these long-term gaming sessions. But there's a few different tricks that I've learned over the years that I think can really help you guys perhaps remedy some of this on your own. So let's get into it. First one being, how level is your chair in relation to your desk? Are they at different elevations? You can see here, I try and have my like armrests parallel to my desk height so you're not at any, any weird angles. You can I can even like rest my elbows on my chair as I'm playing and I've scooted all the way forward so there's like no gap or anything like that. The second thing is how is your wrist supported or is it not at all? Are you just flying the mouse around? Most people probably just play with the mouse out, no wrist rest. But it's one thing because I actually like aim mostly with my like wrist in, in hand. I actually don't do a lot of forearm movement, uh, very little. I maybe lift up my arm every once in a while. But generally I'm flicking <clears throat> in Valorant, for example, with my wrist. And so one thing that I picked up from Glorious Gaming is this little like wrist pad, which will be linked in um, the description of this video, so something to check out. And the third thing that I would recommend is, do you have any support on your keyboard? Are you, is your left hand or right hand, if you're a lefty using the mouse, it's getting confusing, is your wrist supported as you are typing on your keyboard? Or is there like, again, is your hand angled upward or, or arched or whatever it may be as you're trying to reach for these keys and yeah. You can see here, I've got this little like support bar that came with my keyboard, but it's something that you should look into. There's a whole bunch of different like wooden ones. Again, Glorious Gaming has some great options. I'm not sponsored by them at all. I really just think that they have some good products. So guys, I hope some of these tips and tricks were helpful. Again, like with those three things were in place for me, then I was able to like game a lot longer and game without pain, especially when I was getting like super competitive into Fortnite. It takes a grind, you know, like mentally, Physically, you, you kind of start to feel it. And so just some stuff to consider as you're out there. Guys, if this video helped you, drop a like. And if not, go out and have a great day anyway. Peace.